Hello everyone. It is Saturday, November 7th. Uh, if you're new to my channel, my name is Marcelo. Uh, Part-time reseller, started about four months ago and just kind of journeying what that looks like to start as a reseller. Uh, if you'll please like, subscribe if you enjoy this kind of content and ring the notification bell. If you are not new here, I told you last time that I needed to organize Sorry, taking the dog out. I uh, need to organize the storage unit. So we did purchase a shoe rack uh, on Amazon. I've seen another reseller get and, and really enjoyed. So that's not here yet. Hopefully it'll be here today, if not Monday or Tuesday. But I did get two large, seem to be sturdy metal shelves on Facebook Marketplace yesterday. So I'll share that with you as well and take you through the entire cleanup of the unit process. I know I said I don't do this, but I went to the local Salvation Army a few days ago and actually found a couple decent items in there. So, uh, and again, I know a lot of resellers sell used items and that wasn't really what I was interested in uh, before, but I think I'm gonna try it. and. You know, we'll see what happens. So here we go. Just got back from Salvation Army, picked up, uh, I think it was two boots and a pair of Skechers. So all in all, it's probably about six or eight pair of, of shoes or sandals or boots this week from Salvation Army. I'll show you guys later. The the shoe shelf was here when we got back, so we will hopefully put that together today at the storage unit. Um, let's go over there. All right, I am going to, well, I think this is the shoe rack anyway. I'm gonna start assembling this here because I've already got plenty to do at storage unit. So let's see if we can at least do the horizontal racks right now. We are headed over to the storage unit. I have the shoe rack that we assembled the uh, horizontal shelves at the house. So that way it'd be much quicker to assemble the rest once we get there. Um, probably going to build the metal shelves first and get those uh, in a good position and then figure out where the shoe rack's gonna be. So off to the storage unit. Definitely get another one. 
All right, so the storage room is looking good, organized. Um, I know I told you guys we'd go through some of the items that we purchased at Salvation Army. So we'll go through a, a five or six, seven of those items right now and see what we got. All right, the first shoe is uh, Clark's brand booty uh, casual slip on. The average price for everything here was $3.43. Uh, the next one is a Blake Scott, uh, about a knee-high suede boot. Then we have another Clark's. These are actually really good condition. Uh, men's, I think size 11. And then I have two uh, Poly Hawaii, one green, one brown sandal. Uh, both of them were, were brand new. And then I got a pair of golf shoes, uh, Foot Joy Classics. Um, these went anywhere from 30 to 40 bucks on eBay. Hello Kitty uh, ceramic reusable hot uh, coffee cup with a rubber lid. Then I got a Heineken, like a ceramic uh, beer stein. That was, uh, I think, $1.50. Uh, and then a uh, cool looking coffee cup that said, I got tipsy in, and it's actually a, a tip coffee cup was 81 cents. Found a pair of Crocs, size 13. Um, the bottom's a little worn, but not too bad. And besides that, they look brand new. Uh, Rain boot, this one didn't have a brand. Uh, I think I got this one for $5. Listed it for 20, I believe. Uh, this brand is called Hotter. Never heard of it, but seemed to be doing $30 to $40. Um, the bottom of these look like they were, weren't even used, so should be good. That is all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you'll please hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already. Um, who knows, if we sell any of these uh, Goodwill or Salvation items, maybe we'll go back and get more. So uh, again, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.